Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Fingers Valley in Transport Fever 2. Um, yeah, I did put too many trains on that uh, on that line last time. I took one off and that sorted out. I see here, yeah, this was because there was one too many trains and they were running basically empty, one of them. So uh, I took that off and uh, got the... Uh, um, Oh, we got new cargoes and work. Yeah, I'm just going to call it work now uh, until I forget to call it that. Uh, so now we've got, you know, a million or so in, because uh, this is when I sold the train. Uh, we've got a million or so here, a million or so here. Um, this may turn around, but it was way lower than that, you know, 170K, right? So uh, I definitely needed to sell the train, uh, one of them. I still think the third train on there is a good idea uh, for the long run, though. So as long as it doesn't cause cash hemorrhaging, uh, I'm going to uh, leave, it, uh, leave it in place. If we get uh, a million plus, a million plus, and then a quarter million loss, half a million loss, million plus, it, it, it's fine. And we just had a whole bunch of stuff deliver there, and it uh, turned around the number, right? Uh, so it, it can turn around quite quickly. Uh, but the running costs really do add up, right? Uh, so uh, especially the uh, half a million in uh, road vehicles, right? Uh, anyway... Um, is that going to stay positive? Yep, it stayed positive. Uh, okay, so million and a half, million and a half, million and a half. Okay, uh, so I think we're okay there. Uh, and that means uh, it's time to go and look at some other project. Now, I want to do something other than passengers. Um, I mean, I could run passengers up to Buffalo and then on up to uh, Simi Valley and Cary and Roseville with a nice long line up that way. Uh, but I think that's going to be a little too uh, that's going to be a little too uh, resource draining uh, before it pays off. Instead, I'm looking at the possibility of a freight operation over here. Uh, now, uh, is there any uh, production chain over here that I can do completely without having to get up onto the plateau? Now, here, take a look. See, we'd have to get up that to get up on the plateau there, right? So that's not a good uh, industry to uh, aim for. Uh, I don't see a complete uh, chain over here. Um, we do have uh, the quarry to the conmats. Uh, now, is there a conmats demand uh, in Centennial? That looks like a project. Okay, so we're going to uh, take uh, stone from El Monte Quarry to El Monte Conmats plant, and then we'll take the Conmats back to Centennial, where uh, I'm going to uh, set up some sort of a freight hub, I think, uh, and truck it into Centennial. So maybe set up a freight hub out here where it can collect uh, stuff from everything around here uh, at this uh, crossroads. And uh, yeah, I think that's probably what I'll do. But I'll make a direct connection from here into here. So uh, the, the, let's uh, drop the clock rate down. Now, uh, that's going to need a freight station with one track here. Um, yeah, one track. Okay. Um, and it can go like 
this. Uh, if I put it, yeah, I'll put it there like th No. I'm going to put it on an angle like that. Uh, why? Uh, because I have some sort of notion of... That's a passenger station, you idiot. Um... Yeah, do that instead. Yeah, okay. Then we go up here. We're going to need two uh, platforms. Uh, because I don't want the trains conflicting on their dwell time here, right? Uh, for the pickup and the drop-off. So if I put it here, yeah. Now. Uh, tracks. Yeah. I want to... Do I want to keep the freight separated from the passenger here? I think I probably do. Or do I? Hmm. Yeah. Okay, that's, that's a cost uh, uh, thing to do that. Um... No, over here, yeah, I think it does need to be separated. Uh, in that case, I'm going to need uh, a couple of uh, tracks coming off of here. And we're going to need to go that way. Yeah, we're going to need to go that way. And I think punch through the, uh, the hill here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, if we keep that flat... Right? So we can do that. And we can do this. Slip that. Yeah, otherwise I'll forget to do it if I leave it for later. Now, I need to come out of here and I need to go up and over this stuff, I think. So, well, I could go over here. No, I think I want to go over this stuff and punch through the hill. Now, nah, I want to come around. Uh, no, I want to use the hill to get over the road. Yeah, that's what I want to do. So if I come across... Oh, well, that's higher than I need to go. I think here is high enough. Yeah. Okay. That is high enough. Okay. So we can come across like that. Downhill. Um, no, that's higher than it needs to be still. Okay. No, that's not high enough. Okay. Okay. That's high enough. Yeah. That is high enough. Well, if I build it and then see what this does. No, I can I can back this up a bit. Yeah. Okay. And this, okay, come on. Orbital bombardment view doesn't work for building things. Collision, oh, right. We're gonna need to level that a bit. Why is that collision? Okay. Okay, so if we come down like this, down like this, yeah, and then down like this. Yep, 
and then down like this. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, and we can punch through like this. No. Uh, we'll come... Uh, uh, Level-ish. There. Okay, and then... Uh, we can come across here. Now, how bad is the embankment? Uh, it's not terrible. Okay. And then this, uh, which side is that? Okay, it's that side. Okay. Right, and then this can come in like that. Yeah, okay. Uh, okay, so if we bring that across, ooh, it fits, okay. Um, okay, come on. Uh-huh. Then this can come snake around there slowly. And around through here. You know, there's an easier way to do this. Yeah, I know. I could have just punched it through the uh, mountain. Right. Okay, so that, that gets that connected there. I'm going to need one of these. Yeah, just like that. Yep. Um, and then from here, I need to get over there. Okay. So I kind of need to get on to here. Which means, I think I want to come out like this. But level, I think. Uh, how egregious is that? Uh, I don't think it is. Okay. Take it. Now, do the other one. Okay. So we've got a track coming that way which needs to get up and over or get through here. Um, actually, would it be better to just, hmm, would it be better to just come over it? Yeah, I think it would. Because we're not crossing the track here. We're coming up to, yeah. Uh, okay. In that case, uh, we want to come up kind of like this. Uh huh. Okay, so we would come out like this. Like this, maybe. Yeah? Yeah, I think that works. Okay. Okay, so if I, is that do, that looks like it's doing the right thing. Okay. Um Okay, in that case we don't need this. Um okay. Yep. Now, theoretically, that allows us to launch a train on here without um, without having to connect up to uh, some other uh, thing. Uh, I build another depot. That's that's uh, that was the terminology I was looking for. But I think perhaps a depot over down here might not be a miss. Uh, what are you going to do? I'm going to do this. What, are you making space for a yard or something? Yeah, something like that. Uh, okay. Uh, wang that around. 
Okay. Uh, tracks. Yeah, we're going to. We're going to do this. Right. Okay. Um, you know what? Probably. Whoops. Uh, probably, uh, smart to do this. Yeah, okay. Right. Now we need a train. Uh, steam is our, our thing still. Now the mogul. Um, 400 kilowatts, uh, it's 75. 310, 213. Yeah, we'll go with the mogul. Uh, and cargo. Uh, we need uh, gondolas. Uh, that one. Let's go with 10 cars for now. Uh, we'll probably need more, but uh, this will get a train running. Uh, new line goes from... Uh, let's pause it while we do this here to here. Yeah. Okay. And that's going to be, uh, Elm. Quarry to, to Elm Conmat, right? Okay, we'll call this El Monte Quarry, right? And we'll call this El Monte Conmat Factory. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's just for my CDO. Um, yeah. Okay. Good. Now we come down here. We grab this guy. Yeah. Nope. We come down here and we grab this guy. Yep. Let's um, let's up the tempo and uh, take a wander through here. I need to put signals on that other line, and that's fine. Uh, that's not going to be a, a big issue. Yeah, I think this would be a good spot to do some sort of a yard operation, right? Right, so we head off into here, and then we... Right, that's the split for the passenger lines. We go through the interesting landscape, right? And then here's the split point, right? Yeah. Okay. Right. There's the station with the siding. Yep. And we go up a bit. And then we go down. Round, wobble, wee. Okay, yeah, that works. Okay, good. So we have nothing to drop off. Now we go back. Okay, uh, I'll leave this open. Uh, well, 
slow the uh, tempo down. Now I'll put the signals on. Okay, so we need a signal here for sure. Um, need uh, signals here. Uh, I'm going to need a signal here and one here. Yeah? Yeah. Let's uh, speed things up. Uh, yeah, we'll put a signal there. And one more set right about here. Uh, okay. Now, we'll jump on board here. And we'll head on in and pick up some uh, stone. Right? Um, and then we head on back. Actually, we might have about the right size train here. Yep, okay. Jump out of here. I just want to watch it do the delivery. The whole reason I did that bridge affair there is because I needed to get across uh, the rail line, right? Uh, 420k, so... Right. Okay. I didn't check. Um, edit. Do we have the faster... No, we don't have the faster wagons yet. Okay. Might want to go with a weaker engine here. Might. Um, so if I take the mogul off and I go for... This does 45, that does 40, that does 64. 181. 1.4. Yeah one yeah that's probably a good idea and it's still mediocre okay you do 50 at 200 kilowatts um modify yeah uh that should uh that should reduce the uh running costs uh finances uh, yeah, okay, uh, might be able to drop back to, ev to an even, uh, uh, weaker one, actually, because this is relatively level, um, no, that does appear to be, uh, coming out positive, um, okay, well, I'll keep that window up, we'll just go over here and take a look, at where the con mats are desired over here. Um, right, now I can get that here. Okay, the con mats are wanted over here. Okay, and that doesn't cover it. So I'm going to have to uh, do a trucking operation anyway. Um, I don't have any other passenger connections coming into here no I won't have any other passenger connections coming into there okay they'll connect here or up there okay um, well in that case I can go in here <clears throat> running costs have inched up to even And we need a delivery. Well, we, yeah, it's inched up past even, but then there comes a delivery. 
Yeah, I think that should be fine. Okay. Uh, right. So, I think maybe I can just put a freight station right here. So, if I configure this, uh, put a track here. So, I'll need one more passenger track here, right? Uh, for the uh, long haul uh, connection. No, platforms. And then we'll need a cart. Cargo. Um, platform um, I think just the one cargo platform is probably fine so now I'm going to I'm going to go and put a uh, cargo building um, cargo ramp type building yeah I'll put it over here yeah okay and then i can go in here for a truck station i'll just make it 30 meters long because that is um uh cooler um Now, I'm going to put it right there. Yeah? Yeah. 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 Okay. Now, we need a uh, street, which comes up to here. Yeah. Yeah, that will do. Okay. Right now, we need to also, actually, no, don't put it on the angle like that. Um, uh, put it straight over this way. Yeah. Okay, and then we go straight out this way straight out this way kill that good that's kind of what I want there okay now I need to get the tracks sorted out here uh, I can close that now and uh, come out straight here and flat. No. Maybe I want to do this. Yeah. Okay. Then do this. Yeah. And then do this. Nope. Nope. Okay, extend that a bit. Yeah. Then, nope. Nope. Apparently, we need to go from this side. Nope. Nope. Uh, okay. Oh, that's got it. Okay. And this can come in here. Right? Okay. Now. Uh, for now, we'll just do this. Right? And this. No. Do that, do that, yeah, okay, right, um, no, it's here, signals, just the one there, take that one out, yeah, okay, 
Right. Now, okay, so positive, net positive, okay. Um, manage vehicle. Um, actually, go over and look at the uh, cargo waiting. Um, how full is it? Ah, it's running... Uh, less than full okay uh, okay so we can uh, edit this and put a uh, what is it it's a PV uh, you do you do 50 uh, you do your 180 your 121 your 145 I think that's probably powerful enough Yeah. Add. And I think uh, if we look in here, our rate, the rate's 141. That's, um, huh. Okay, so here we got 41 to pick up when it gets there. Yeah, okay. So if we take that off. No. Add that back. Yeah. Modify. Okay. Now, we need a flat car coming from there to, uh, uh, to Centennial, right? So I'll just uh, uh, grab one of those over here. Uh, buy vehicles, flat car. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Let's we'll just put... Well, that's got to run twice as far, so I'll put a full-length train on there. Uh, what's the demand over here uh, in Centennial? Uh, 64, okay. Yeah, that's probably fine. Uh, okay, and we're going to go with... Was it this guy? No, it was this guy. Yeah, we'll go with that guy again. Yeah. Okay. Uh, buy one. Now we can go in here. New line. And that needs to come all the way from down here. Uh, to here. Yeah. And that is Elm... On mat to sent delivery. Right. Uh, okay. Now I'm going to need a road vehicles uh, depot thingy. Uh, building. Yeah. Uh, one of those. Um. Nah, I'll, I'll put it in right about uh, here. But I need to do this first. So put that right there. Yep. Then we grab a street and do this. Yeah, okay. Buy. What do we need? Uh, cargo. Nope. All cargo. Well, that holds con mats. It does 20. 
and it takes five. That's all cargo. Oh, that's, hmm. That's the Asian flatbed. Um, okay. 5k a year. They're all, all the same. Okay, so... That's 4 kilowatts. That's 4 kilowatts. All, that takes 5. Yeah, okay. Uh, I'll go with... 5 of them? Yeah, okay. And I'm going to need to go in here. Building. I'm going to need one of these. Um... Drop it here. Now here. Here. Here, I think. There, I think, yeah. Okay. So we go in here and we... New line from here to here. And that is sent freight delivery. Yeah. Uh, okay. Right. That should be. Ah, we're bringing 10 con mats in. Uh, okay. That's going to be. Uh, somewhat useful. Oh, we're up to uh, almost 17 million in the bank. Uh, right. Uh, there we, we're coming with con mats. We're making con mats. Or construction materials, if you prefer. Or bricks. Basically bricks. Right. Bricks and probably stone facing slabs. Bricks. Um, okay. In we come. Uh, we have a profit on 10 con mats, 130k. And then they appear here. I like the three horses look. It's kind of weird. Um, right. And that goes off on its way. Right, okay, so that will uh, will do its thing. I'll probably need to add more. But it's uh, a freight operation. Now, I think I'll probably be putting the freight hub for this area right in here. Because that can catch everything over here. Like, if I face it this way, I can, actually, I can run a main line this way and a main line up here, and then a main line out here, right? So it can be a proper hub. Um, and really, I just need a classification yard, right? Where uh, you, you bring, like this would be the perfect uh, use for a shunting operation, right? Where, uh, where if the game did shunting, where you could uh, have the train drive in, drop off its uh, cars, and then pick up the cars for wherever destination it's going, right? Uh, and that would be... But that would be a different game altogether, right? Uh, it would take quite a bit of uh, uh, work for them to implement that. Uh, but yeah, I, I basically want a classification yard here. So it's basically a case where the cargo comes in, gets dropped off, and then uh, uh, picked up by a train going where it needs to go. Or trucks! Um, yeah, so it'll be also an interchange point. Is if I put it put it up here, actually, if I put it not connected to here directly, hmm. Yeah, I think anyway. Uh, the idea I think is going to be I'll put a, a freight yard over here, 
and then uh, probably here and then we can uh, then re and then finagle all of that stuff I uh, not sure how well that's going to work what with industries that close down and open up and all of that but uh, something to keep in mind though is that if you, you'll need exactly two of these to fill one of these so it's still going to make sense to have a direct link from these to here and then here to here and then bring this back but I might not do that uh, I, I haven't uh, I haven't figured out what I'm going to do exactly. Uh, but that was a uh, a freight line. Yeah. Uh, and that should, and that one has a high enough frequency that uh, it should start uh, dropping uh, stuff in here a little bit faster. Uh, and once uh, Centennial, the Centennial uh, Conmats beds in, um, right, uh, with uh, uh, with all of the uh, like all of this stuff beds in right uh, see is up here we've got 37 waiting right uh, yeah so uh, overall uh, I think a successful uh, adventure today uh, and it's still uh, working off of the existing uh, uh, network uh, operations so uh, you know without going off in the middle of nowhere uh, green field right but anyway that's all for this project uh, so uh, yeah I'll put the cut here and I'll just mention before I go I do have a patreon if you want to support the channel so uh, you know the links in the doobly-doo uh, it's entirely up to you I only put it there in case somebody wants to. Uh, it's I'm not begging or anything. Uh, yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, that said, that's all for this time. See you back next time.